Hello and welcome to another weekly vlog. If you're new here, my name is Jessica and I'm a final year PhD student at the University of Aberdeen. My research is in the area of natural products chemistry, which is basically trying to find new and bioactive compounds from living organisms. Hello, good morning. This lighting is awful. <laughs> we are starting the day in biological sciences because I had to take a reading for the plate reader and I also have to collect some seawater for my experiments. Today keeps getting worse, honestly. So what I was trying to say before was that the plate reader is not working, <laughs> which is what I use to take all of my bioassay uh, data. So that's fun. And now I've forgotten my card. It's downstairs and I need to go to the lab upstairs to get the seawater. Why is nothing working out this morning? So to give you an update, the plate reader has not been fixed, which is really annoying. Um, but I'm going back in the afternoon and hopefully it's fixed then. I think I'd mentioned before that I'm supposed to be writing just now. Last week I hardly wrote anything because I'm trying to troubleshoot experiments which are going wrong. They should, in theory, not take very much time, but because my bacteria are misbehaving, it means that everything is taking a lot longer than it should. So I am really craving a day of getting some words down on paper and feeling productive again. I'm also trying to solve the structure of a new compound that I've isolated, which is really exciting because it's contributing, you know, to chemistry of the marine invertebrates that I'm working on. But we are also encountering some problems with that, so that is also taking a lot longer than I would have hoped. So yeah, stress levels are a little bit high at the moment and I just feel so tired with the change of the seasons. I'm being such a negative Nancy right now, I'm so sorry, but I'm just being honest and just being real about the situation. But now we're going to try and run some other NMR experiments to try and help us find out more information about the structure of this compound because we are contributing to our knowledge about this marine organism. Hello friends and happy Wednesday. Sorry about the noise. I'm in the microbiology room. The shaker is on. There's nothing I can do about it, I'm sorry. I've been at home all day and it's currently half past four and I have just arrived at the lab because I was giving myself today to do writing because I think I mentioned yesterday that I haven't written anything in like two weeks and I'm supposed to be in the writing up phase of my PhD but my bacteria are causing me lots of problems. So to get those thoughts and that frustration out of my system, I spent the day at home trying to write and I started another one of my results chapters and made some good progress, I would say. Maybe not as much progress as I would have liked, but that's okay. So now I'm at the lab because I still need to play around with my bacteria and see if they're going to cooperate with me. And then I'm gonna to try to go to the gym because I've not been looking after myself well enough recently, I would say. So I want to try and go to the gym, get a workout in and then go home and maybe continue writing. Actually, no, I can't continue writing. I need to edit this week's video to go up tomorrow because it's already Wednesday. My video should be ready for tonight, but it's not ready. Uh, on the way to the university, I also ran some errands. I had about four packages to return, which I've just been sitting in my room, making clutter, also making clutter for my mind so I was happy that I could tick something off of my list so I got that done on the way here but yeah things were just busy and I feel like my brain is being split in all sorts of different directions at the moment and yeah I would like more time at home to write so I can feel a bit lighter <laughs> Anyway, I'm going to make some overnight cultures and then we're going to go to the gym. So I'll probably speak to you guys maybe later, but probably tomorrow. Good morning, friends. Happy Thursday. I can't see a thing because the sun is shining in my eyes. I'm walking to the lab just now. It's nine o'clock. I have some things to do with the bacteria that I made last night. And then I want to spend the rest of the day writing up that result chapter that I was speaking about yesterday. So that's the plan. Let's see if my bacteria have cooperated or if they're still causing me problems. Little update, it's 20 past four and today has not been as productive as I would have hoped in terms of writing. So of course I was in the lab in the morning, so that was no writing time. I've come to my other office now at the decommissioning centre where I have a nice big desk, screens, and I've probably written like 200 words. I've been changing figures, I've been trying to organise my thoughts on how to organise the chapter and yeah, not much writing has actually 
been done. So that's quite annoying. I'm going to be getting a train on Saturday to Edinburgh to meet someone very exciting who you will see later in the vlog uh, that you might know from YouTube, you might know from Instagram. And I'm trying, gonna plan to try and get some writing done then because I have a goal that I want to finish the results section of one of my chapters before the end of the week. Whether that's gonna happen or not, I don't know. Anyway, I need to pack up my stuff, go to the gym to play squash and tomorrow is a new day, I guess. Hello, good morning, happy Friday. So I'm starting the day this morning by recording a podcast. So I have very kindly been invited to be on a podcast. I'm not gonna disclose any information about it now, but when it's released, I will 100% let you know. So that's really cool. And that was something that just came about through this YouTube channel, through my Instagram account. And I was very kindly invited to be a guest on the podcast. So that's what we're doing this morning. And then I'm gonna be spending the rest of the day at home trying to get some writing done and then heading to my group meeting in the afternoon. I've already packed my bags to go to Edinburgh this weekend, which I'm very excited about. Be nice to get out of Aberdeen, be nice to just have a little trip away. If the trains are running, because apparently there are more train strikes, so I don't know what's happening there. But anyway, to prepare for the podcast, I'm going to check that my mic, camera, everything is okay, look over the potential questions, and yeah, get it recorded. So I'll speak to you after. Hello, I'm back. So I was all ready for the meeting, and it turns out that the calendar has made the time difference wrong so it's actually in half an hour now so i've got half an hour to kill might have a look at my thesis for half an hour realistically it's not going to be a very productive half an hour but i can at least try and do something <laughs> How to use my phone and they got me a YouTuber. Yes, that's <laughs> <laughs> Hello, I'm in Edinburgh with a friend that I have from YouTube and from Instagram. <laughs> Hello, I'm in Edinburgh as I mentioned earlier in the vlog and I have met a very special friend who I've spoken to multiple times on the internet and I think she is maybe vlogging me right now, I don't know what happened but I am here with Beth Hello. at Bethology on YouTube, YouTube and on Instagram. All the above, yeah. yeah. So yeah, it's been so nice to actually meet someone from the socials in person because yeah, I've never done that before. It feels like exactly the same. Which yeah. Is really funny. And now we're getting shy because of people, people coming. People coming. I know, but we had a nice lunch and it was really fun and we had some drinks. Okay, bye. <laughs>